Hey guys, not Master Prime here. Well, since Modern Warfare 2 beta has been long gone, we're back at Vanguard. And uh, right now, I'm just checking out what's what's new. Uh, I heard it's another modern modern gun in the game. In a World War II game. Yeah, I know. I'm beating a dead horse right here. So, what do you want me to do? So... Today we're just basically checking out the store and let's, let's see what's let's see what's good on it. All right, first off, Sarah. For those who likes Black Ops Three and Black Ops Four, your Asian Iron Hand woman is right there. Uh, although there are some problems because it's Vanguard, and of course there's problems with Vanguard. Why wouldn't it? For starters, weapons are underwhelming. We only get like blueprints for like old weapons, but it's Vanguard, so kind of makes sense. Although here's the problem: the only rep rep representative, rep the only thing that represents the Annihilator is now a charm. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, I think there's a there's a kill streak that already has a hand cannon in. I think I am not too sure. I'll go check it up if I if there isn't. If not, then I'll say if it's not. But till then, uh, it may or may not. So there is the character. Simple enough. Looks like from Black Ops 4. Just straight up from Black Ops 4. Minus the all face paint and all that stuff. But to be honest, if you're if you know me, I'd rather have fire break. That's just me. I'd rather have fire break. Oh, oh if, if you all put me if you put fire break on this in this game, I would be like I'll have a little fun before before MW2 comes out, but nope. You put Seraph. Some people, I know some, I know it's like a fan favorite, but to me, Firebreak was the best, the best of the best for me. That and Prophet, or what people are gonna call him as Booker T. Now before we move on to the bundle, I went back to the home the home state just for this so we don't have to like ruin the what's going on in there. But uh Look at this. Look at this. They put I mean, an animations on this thing, showing how it looks. To be honest, this looks this looks freaking awesome. But unfortunately, the thing is like, it's kind of too late. And if it, if they done this more on the uh, other bundles, it would have been even more cool. But since uh, we're all, since we're like we're almost at the end, like this is like okay. But are you really gonna buy this? I mean, we are in October. So that means we have like 27 days left for the before the full game comes out. I mean, that's just me. Also, the monsters are back. That's right. You can all get your King Kong, Godzilla, and Mecha Godzilla if you want. But remember, they're all going to work for just Vanguard and Warzone 2020. Yeah, that's it. Just Warzone. 2020, nothing else. Um, if you want to get them, go right ahead. But keep in mind, you can't get them in the next game. So, the choice is yours. Alright, so obviously I'm going to buy the Seraph bundle. Because... Um, I like Black Ops 4. Again, prefer Firebreak, but hey... This is the only uh, good representation of BO4 we're gonna get in this game, so why the why the heck not?
Yeah, I'm not dealing with the quotes things on me. Uh, I am gonna equip this. Oh yeah, she's ready. She's ready about to ram that fizz right in somebody's face with that goddamn iron fist. Literally, she literally has an iron fist. Have I mentioned that Black Ops 4 is a little up there? I haven't? Well, now you know. Alright, so I got some few. Went online and checked out how to unlock the gun stuff. Simple. Uh, apparently, we just need to use a, a somewhere around like a sniper scope or a tactical rifle scope. I don't know, the optic that has like 3.5, and basically, yeah, that's about it. So I'm just gonna use the, the laser gun again, and just spray, 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 and yeah, that's it. So basically I'm gonna be at Small Map Mayhem, just get all those shots easily, and yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Oh, if, if you do me a favor, uh, make sure to like the video, share it, subscribe and all that stuff, and if you don't wanna miss out on a new video, Click the bell. It's free. Enjoy the video. Alright, welcome to Eagle's Nest. And, uh, wow. Um, Alright, folks, if you hear some people in, and I'm sorry, I have, I'm not wearing my headphones on. Okay, I don't know sure what you're saying, but. You know what? I'm just gonna be there. God damn, this game goes good with this. Um, I forgot to mention that uh, after I uh, invested on getting three monitors on this game, I have not played this game in it. Last time I played this was on my old TV. And I'm telling you right now, this looks crispy, crispy clear. Holy lord, this looks so good. I mean, that's just me. I thought... Alright, got intel. Nice. I was hungry there. I was hungry for a drop. Ooh. Okay. Kinda my What the hell? That is not one of those costumes you get from Sarah. No, that's that's a little bit that's just punkish, but then again, he is wearing it. Because it's not old. Probably because it's not World War II gun. Of course. And I see this guy is doing the uh, eye patch. The eye patch guy. Ooh, if you give him a goddamn block, a giant sword kind of reminds me of that of certain black swordsman. Oh boy, that's like the one thing I did enjoy um, on MW. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay. Probably should check the uh, menu for. Oh, fudge. Oh, fudge. They're, oh, fudge. They're everywhere. Friendly 
Ah, uh, we lost. Ah. Uh, okay, we did 10 kills, so now we just need five more kills. Which is not bad. Not bad. Oh god, this character, this, this skin. Oh man. Alright, I'm back. Turns out I need to have a little more shots in. So let's get our two shots and get them. Yeah. got the gun we need and honestly I'm deciding to stay with the small maps or go for like either just put TDM and that's it but uh, I'll decide on the next on the next scene so yeah all right we're back and we're I decided we just we just play some few rounds from TD team that match and call it a call it a night uh yeah we're i'm recording at midnight so i'll try to get some few games and overall see how good the gun is i could have bought the the blueprint model but honestly i just told myself nah don't spend money on don't spend your money on vanguard besides you know the same plant a win so headphones on the lead down and let's go on. Oh, by the way, uh, looks like the Terminators are gone now. I haven't seen them in it, so. What's the standard of Birds spinning? Okay. So yeah, there is. Oh, where where the hell is everybody? Thank you, Tracker. And I died. Okay. Yo, the kids fucking gap in the fucking main bay. Everybody just fucking go and swarm his body and shoot that shit up. Fuck that little shit. Look at this shit. in the main bay. Ooh, that... That was... That's a little fast for, uh... For, uh... Main for a new weapon. The main bay anymore. Alright, buddy. We, I know you're trying to do your job. You know what? Mute everybody. I know you're trying to do your job, but I got a video recorded. But yeah, it looks like the rate of fire of this one is like very fast. Um, overall, it's not bad. That's it. Go. Uh, voice actor Sarah. Uh, doesn't sound like the be a force Sarah, but then again, um, I guess getting a other voice actor makes it more cheaper. Oh. 
get up. Oh. Am I running faster or not? Where are you? Alright. I guess it's a little too far to shoot shoot down there. go down some stairs. Oh boy, shotguns are here. I am still getting wrecked by a shotgun. That's Vanguard. Let's just let it go. Stairs. Yay. Is he still there? Yep. Yep. Recon flight scanning the air. Yep. Okay. Alright, I just realized I had to use the. <laughs> I just used the switch weapon. You know, I, I just. Keep going, just keep going. Alright. 11 deaths and 13 kills. Okay, that's a little low. Alright, I'm just here customizing Sarah, but holy lord. That is a really good gold skin. Uh, silver, same thing, just good skin. But I don't think I have time to get these, so. Do I have a man that's a 20? I'm not so, I mean close to 20, I'm not so sure. But uh, regardless, clothes, gold and silver, 10 out of 10. Everything else. This and this, this looks like, I have no idea what we're going with. This one just reminds me of Cyberpunk. Just now. And the default, default, just a classic. I had 8 out of 10 on the classic, classic, 10 out of 10 on gold and silver. And I'm giving you a 6 and I'm giving you a 2 because you, you, you just don't look in that good in that color. 
All right, we're now at decoy. Yeah, the hell is so bad that you would rather saw your leg off and climb to life maimed than stay in that room um, having two feet and, and, and be cast into hell. What? So why would, why would Christ even warn about it if it didn't exist? What I think what it says here in Matthew 26. We took the advantage. What the hell am I hearing? Uh, it says here, the Son of Man goeth as it is written, but woe unto that man by whom the Son of Man is betrayed. It had been good for that man if he had not been born. So talking about Judas here, you know, betraying the Son of Man, and obviously I don't believe Judas, Judas was saved, so he went to hell. But we can take this principle here that it's almost like the Bible's telling us here, hey, if you live and you die and go to hell, it, it would be better that you were not even born. That's how bad hell is. And you know, you know sometimes people will, when what? you're outside, okay. when people will joke about hell and they'll say like, oh, you know, I don't mind going to hell. You know, I don't care whether I go to hell or not. It's because they don't, they don't realize what hell is like. Because if they honestly understood what hell was like, they wouldn't say things like that. Nobody would want to go to hell. Why would you want to go to a place of fire and torment forever and ever and ever? You wouldn't. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. what's going on here? Like, what, what, what are you talking about? It is. So the Bible says it's here, wait, it's... What's wrong, buddy? Speaking of all this, uh... Team stealth there. Emergency airdrop, coming in hot. Yeah? Alright. Jesus Christ, what was ramming about? And it came, it came to the point I had to use a, I had to use my third second mic for that. Am I sending goods your way? Recon flight. Well, I'm putting that in the video, that's for sure. Hey, go back to the what I'm doing right now. All right. All right, I'm clearly gonna. Am I Ooh. God damn, he was freaking out like God and hell and all that stuff in, in, in a Vanguard game. Jesus Lord. Oh. to use it all the time. Use that, use those fists. Use them fists. Use them fists. He's practicing his practicing his Sentinel class for his MW2 debut. That beautiful boy. He's doing his beautiful job as Sentinel. Okay, I can respect that. I respect that. But I'm grinding, so. Ooh. Yeah, I hate 
need to see that. And the grenade would have been a little bit enough. But I guess not. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi. Nah, boy. I am better. Friendly That was a uh, interesting match, especially with the voice chat. Um, that was weird. But anywho, overall, the BP-50, pretty good. Rate of, fast, rate of fire, very fast, as usual. Um, got some few kills. Seraph, always, always a good thing. And uh, yeah, I guess that's about it. Uh, of course, I'm going to have to level up the gun even more so it's probably I'm probably gonna live stream it or gonna do something else with it but regardless uh, this is not the end of me playing Vanguard especially what it looks like right now why is it so crispy I, I have no idea but yeah that's the, I guess I'm gonna end the video right here um, thanks for watching and this has been the review for the BP 50 in Call of Duty Vanguard and this now match is prime to... I have that that one, but you know what? Fuck it. See you the next. See you the next video. Take care. I am better. You are worse. The end. Nice.